Hello viewers, welcome to my channel Deepthi's Fantasies. I have come up with a video where I will tell how can you handle your period stress just by following simple measures. Many of us deal our period stress with a lot of stress and strain but this is not at all required. If you would see, periods are actually a lot beneficial to our body. Like, we women are very observant when it comes to our body. So every month periods offers us hints like with the color of blood and order we can know our medical condition in an easy way. During the beginning of periods our estrogen level actually will go down and after few days it will come up high again and after few days we will actually see your face will start glowing and it will look soft and smooth even your pimples that will get vanished. We will be requiring usually healthy detox and cleansing drinks to cleanse our body but actually the regular periods it naturally cleanses our body so we are very lucky. It is proven that periods will slow down the aging process because there, every month there, there will be lots of iron getting discharged inside our body and that is the main reason women have a longer lifespan than men. Then girls just be happy we are lucky to get periods every month. Let me tell you few simple measures by following them you can handle your period days without any problem. First measure. See to it, you are drinking minimum 8 glasses of water every day during your periods. Because weakness during menstruation is usually caused by dehydration itself because we lose a lot of blood and fluid during this time. And best way to counter attack is to drink plenty of water or any other fluids which contain electrolytes. So ensure you are drinking plenty of water. Second measure. Try to avoid your regular tea and coffee during your period time. And even though you crave for junk food, try to avoid them at least to some extent. Third measure. By consuming fenugreek drink or ginger lemon honey drink, you can control your menstrual cramp pains and even the bleeding. I have provided the recipe of this in my channel. You can get the link in the description box. These four ingredients are magical ingredients to control our menstrual cramp pain. Fourth measure. Heat packs are actually magical during our periods because they give great relief to our abdomen area and if they give great relief for our back pain. If you are feeling a lot of discomfort during your periods, it is better you have this heat pack, get this heat pack ready and then you just dab it on your abdomen area and in your back. If you are available with such heat packs, you can use it on regular basis during your periods because these are a great reliever during your periods. But if you don't have such heat pack in your house, you can make your own hot pack. I have provided the link in description box that how can you do it. I hope that video will be helpful for you. Fifth measure, stop taking medicines during your periods. It is better to avoid any tablets relating to menstrual cramp, pain or bleeding during periods. But you have any such knowledge regarding any tablet that will reduce your menstrual cramp or bleeding. Before consuming it, make an attempt to know about that medicine in a better way. That whether it is beneficial to you or not, what are the side effects of it. And it is best, better to consume any medicine with the doctor's suggestion itself. Sixth measure. Little exercise will be very beneficial for you during your periods. There are many postures that will help you to calm your body during your periods. But this is the posture which is very good. I do it on regular basis. Let me show you. You need to do in this way like how I am showing. This is called butterfly posture. 
Doing this exercise during your periods will help you to soothe your menstrual cramp pains and it will even help for the blood flow to get in a normal way. Try to do it at least once or twice during your periods every day. These are the few tips you can follow during your periods. Try to take warm water bath at least twice a day during your periods because it gives a great relaxation to your body. See to it you are using good sanitary pads which has good hygiene levels. So before buying, see to it you are buying a good one. Everyone will have a great confusion regarding the size of sanitary pads but we have to see that actually the size of sanitary pads we are using it depends on the panty size you can follow this chart this chart will be very helpful for you when it comes to disposing the used pad uh, many of us dispose it in a different different way but uh, you need to see that uh, the disposing of sanitary pad affects a lot to the environment you need to do it in this way this is the actual way of doing it Whenever we take out the sticker which is stick to the sanitary pad before using it, never throw that sticker because that will be helpful for you to dispose the sanitary pad after using it. So after using the sanitary pad, roll the sanitary pad in this way. Never feel awkward while doing it because this is the actual way of doing it. And roll it in the sticker like this. And dispose it. Never flush sanitary pad, you need to throw it in trash itself. And after you do it, you need to clean your hands nicely. Never delay in meeting your gynecologist whenever you are in severe pain and bleeding. I hope this video is helpful for you. Let me know your opinion in the comment section and please like my video and subscribe for further videos. Thanks for watching my video. Have happy periods. Thank you.